So a lot of people on edge today. So very good news that this Barrett Park Dam uh, has been stabilized according to the city, but uh, there is more work to be got to be done and we are seeing an excavator. We are seeing other heavy equipment show up here uh, in order to shore this dam up. It is a key point to several busy populated areas in Lemonster. Some heavy duty equipment rolling in to help shore up a small but critical dam in Barrett Park that could have a huge impact on Lemonster. A break would flood neighborhoods downstream, including the downtown area. So you've got a bag packed. I do. David Hover lives in the target zone and is watching for alerts about the dam. There's a text message. We got to get out of here pretty quickly. Yeah, yeah. Are you prepared for that? I got a bag. Well, we got home last night. I, got a bag. I didn't even unpack the bag. I'm already ready to go. My car's there and we're like ready to go in case. If it does, get my car and I'm out of here. Yeah. <laughs> The rainfall rushed into Barrett Park yesterday, overwhelming the pond and stressing the aging structure. This morning, the mayor deemed the dam the city's biggest concern. I've never seen anything like it. I've been here, I've been here almost 40 years myself, and I've never seen anything like this ever in the town. Longtime Lemonster residents stunned by Mother Nature. With all this rain and again a lot. Like just there's just so much to now contain, and that dam's been there forever. Who knows what's going to happen now? Now, the city tells us they're actually uh, beginning and they're in the midst of a long term project in order to repair and fix this dam. The state, more specifically, the Office of Dam Safety, has actually classified this dam as a quote significant hazard, which means it would have significant problems and hazards to the community if it actually failed. Live in Lemonster, Sarah Conge.